Although daily life is somewhat of a standstill in light of the pandemic, Tyndall Air Force Base reconstruction is moving full speed ahead. As News 13's Erica Orstad tells us, through phone conferences and digital meetings, the planning phase of the rebuild continues on despite challenges that the outbreak has presented. While life as we know it seems to be on hold due to the coronavirus outbreak, Tyndall Air Force Base officials say the rebuild is moving forward every day. I really look at it as more of a speed bump as opposed to a roadblock. Brigadier General Patrice Melanson is the executive director of Tyndall's program management office. She says the team has been teleworking for two weeks now and it's been an encouraging experience. We've been uh, pleasantly surprised at how effective we've been able to be continue to work and to progress even with the limitations that we've had. She added that design plans are still right on schedule and demolition work continues on the base. A major event for Base of the Future brainstorming, AFWorks Fusion, the Air Force's innovation hub, is being pushed back since it is held in June in Las Vegas. But Melanson still has high hopes for the event. We are very excited and still very hopeful that that event will be able to happen in person. Um, if we can't do it in person, I know that the AFWorks team is already looking at ways that we might be able to do things virtually. She says PMO and fighter wing officials are continuing to work together throughout the pandemic and that there has been no change to the five to seven year timeline for the bases rebuilt due to the coronavirus. In Bay County, Eric Orstad, News 13, Panhandle Strong.